In this video, I'm going to show you how to convert FLAC to ALAC on Mac with built-in features, so you don't need to install anything. So, uh, previously, I've shared a shortcut to convert FLAC to ALAC uh, with the FFMPG command, this is this shortcut. Uh, you need to manually install this uh, FF. MPEG uh, open source program it's uh, and then you can run the uh, run this shortcut uh, you can also use this command uh, in the terminal to convert so I happen to found that uh, Apple has a built-in feature it's this uh, AF convert is a command line utility built into uh, Mac OS uh, it's for converting sampling rate and the format of audio files. So then I made a new shortcut, so you don't need to run, uh, install anything. It's this one. So since it's a built-in feature, you, can, you don't actually need this shortcut. You can simply run this command uh, if, when you uh, open the terminal uh, at any folder uh, which the folder uh, contains the FLC file, then you run copy this file, this command, copy this command, you can convert all the FLAC files in that folder to ALAC, uh, to ALAC format. So where I go, if you only want to convert uh, uh, a single file you use this command uh, this is the file name this is the file name this is the output name so let, if you don't always want to type the command you can all simply get this shortcut that I created you simply I'll share the link in the description you just click the link to add it to your Mac so this is our Shortcut is available in the uh, quick action, as a quick action in the finder or service menu. So let me just open finder. So as you see, in this downloads folder, I have two uh, FLAC files. Let me just select this two and right click or double tap. You see the quick action here. You select FLAC to AULAC. Uh, one file is converted and then the other so those two are converted to MLAC to ALAC uh, it's a uh, duplicate and just remove it oh I use this uh, Gamini to uh, detect duplicates files uh, okay Manuminator. So this also allows you to select uh, this. You, as you see, I select two files. You, this also allows you to select a folder. So let me just uh, here this folder FLC to iTunes. Uh, I get two FLC files. Let me select this folder. Uh, right click or double tap. Quick action. AF convert. So one is converted, M4, and another is converted. So if you choose a folder, if you choose a folder, this uh, converted file will be saved in that folder you choose. And if you save multiple files or one files, this uh, will convert to the downloads folder. I you can see the commands here. Uh, I use CD downloads to take convert to the downloads folder. You can change this command to uh, uh, any folder, or you can just uh, use the uh, get file path and uh, CD to the uh, existing uh, to to your choosing folder uh, to the. Uh, you can change this uh, this this command here, so. Uh, that's uh, pretty much it for this video. Hope you find it helpful. Uh, as always, thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next one.